and welcome back to HD Gaming. I am Hyperdiamond 100, and today we're going to play, again, some more Cooking Simulator. Today, however, some things may be different. As you can probably tell from looking at the screen, the pizza update has finally been released. And, well, I might have got it. So today, we are going to be making some pizza. Let's see here. Fulfill your dream of running a real pizzeria. Prepare authentic dough and tasty sauces. Use professional machines. Complete quests to unlock new products. And complete three master challenges to unlock powerful master perks. Huh. That's pretty cool. Alright. We are in. Tutorial. Oh, wow. Are all tutorial icons that weird? Hello and welcome to Papa Pepe's Pizzeria. I see great promise in you. So much that I'd like to share some of my secrets, and if you prove yourself, I'm even let you run this pizzeria. I'm sure you already know this. Let's cover from the basics first. I'll show you how to assemble a pizza from already prepared ingredients, bake it in the oven, and finally serve it. Okay. First, let's build the base for our pizza. Have to roll out pizza dough. Do we get to make our own dough eventually? Place it on the bake board? Is this a bake board? I'm gonna go with yes. Enter the creation view. Oh, yes. Uh, let's roll that. Let's assemble this pizza. We'll start with the sauce. In the future, you have to prepare ingredients yourself. This is the shelf where GN containers are kept. I... What does that mean? I don't know. GN. Remember, you can only use the ingredients that have been stored in a GM computer beforehand and slaughtered into the shelf. Does this mean that we'll, like, eventually not be able to... We'll have to, like, make our own stuff? Sauce. Okay. That is not the like, most even of pizza. Let's get some mozzarella. Why does it have to be so, like, perfectly even? A few basil leaves will do the trick. We'll end up with a classic margarita. Oh! This is the herbs and spices. Nice, okay. Where do I put the basil? Why is the template a square? Oh, I guess this game's still in early access. That could be why. All right then, um, our pizza is ready to be put in the oven. The oven needs to be prepared first. We have to put wood in the oven? That is really cool. Keep fueling it with wood until the thermometer turns green. That is... That is a level of realism I did not expect to see. All right, the oven is ready. Now let's shove your pizza into the oven. But don't try to do it with your bare hands. Why not? I want to burn off my hands. All right, let's grab the pizza. And into the oven you go. There you go, my pizza. Oh, God. Yet another example of it being in early access. Pizza take. The ultimate in explanatory stuff. All right, so he said watch the temperature. Incinerate? There's an incinerate button? I really want to press it. Oh, God, I want to press it. Sounds like we're going to have to do a sandbox episode of this so that I can incinerate it. Can I still serve it after it's been incinerated? All right. Pizza is served. Let's get it out, I guess. Pizza underscore take. Execute action. Now that's one beautiful margarita. Did the cheese just, like, evaporate over the entire pizza? What? Is this how we serve our pizza? Through the serving window? Oh. And we are back. That was very interesting. This time, let's try not to kill the plate. So I'm gonna go with this is not, in fact, the serving window. Let's see. Reward, margarita, money, and XP. This is, your, this is my orders app. I have to choose which orders I want to complete. I only have one active order. Okay, done. And then it just floats off into the void, of course. <laughs> yes, dough, perfection. Sauce, not at all horrible. Cheese, and definitely just throw lumps of it in. What about my ingredients? Basil leaf, three stars. Ah, uh, uh, this is fun. You've proved you can prepare a proper Italian pizza. Now we prepare our pizzeria for tomorrow. You 
don't have to rush. Take your time. The preparation phase has no limit. That is different from the original game. Prepare some dough, just like what we had. Press button to return to the main screen. Uh, I don't have that button on my keyboard. Oh, it's tab. What else do we have? Bella Pizza, that's the order thing. Quest Villa. Hmm, I wonder what that could give. Use Perk Hub imported directly from cakes and cookies. Oh man, this has an interesting level of realism. We have to make dough, sauces, and the pizza. All right, let's uh, pin this. Launch Quest Villa app. Ah, here we go. An application dedicated to elite world-class pizza yolos. What if I hack it? <laughs> Challenges and tasks to improve my skills and gain new abilities. Fame, respect, and the skill certifications, as well as new ingredients, apparently. So, so if I do good on an app, then like the farmer's market will say, hmm, fine, I'll give you a carrot. This is exceptional. Prove yourself to be a diligent apprentice, and I'll grant you the title of novice, and leave you alone to do whatever you please. Additionally, by completing tasks, you get things. Okay, cool, thanks, bye. There's a back room? What's down here? Oh, of course, the pantry. Okay, uh, let's just take stock. I see some explosives, an open window, Lots of paintings, some machine, and uh, a very faded mural on the wall. How nice. Okay, this is capable of preparing huge amounts of dough at once, preparing one or two batches of dough made according to the rest of the last an entire day. Wow. If we turn on the machine, add the ingredients, blah, blah, blah. Whole bag of flour. Ah, they won't get it. Tilt the bottle. Ah, yes, the ultimate bottle. What do I do with this thing? Is there a trash bin? Oh yes, there is. Oh yeah, these boxes. I know you. What do you want me to buy? Uh, water. Okay. Glass bottle water. Nice. Yes. That is an alarmingly small cube. And some salt, I guess. Okay. 125 gram salt. I can change the size of the holes to pour, I can pour one gram or 10 grams. That is gonna make it easier to do 125. Oh no, I put too much. And we are back. Okay, flour. Now let's just rebuy everything that I bought earlier. All right, salt, here we go again. Let's try to uh, successfully do this this time and not put 140 when it only wants 125. Okay, 120. Five. There we go. All right, water. 2.4 liters. Does that bottle have this in it? Nope, it only had one liter. That is uh, very interesting. And now we'll add the bottle. And this one we have to be careful with it. Only add 400 milliliters. Liquid's always so finicky. This is why measuring cups were invented. But I'm lazy, so I'm just gonna eyeball it with my like psychic milliliter measuring powers. There we go, that seems acceptable. And yeast, 10 grams. How much are you? 10 grams. All right, you get to go into this. For safety reasons, it has to be closed. Oh my God, there's an entire maintenance panel. Yes, please. Oh, so the red button would have cleared the salt away. Okay. Uh, click. Hmm. Awesome. Let's discuss sauces. Uh, okay. That's a few ingredients. Oh, I'm done my quest. Ah, now I get to prepare sauce. Okay, uh, is the dough done? Ah, uh, the dough seems to have vaporized. <laughs> ah, yes, the ideal circumstance. Pick up a basket, 16 tomatoes, and four garlic cloves. Okay, I can do that. San Marzano tomato. I feel like this pizza expansion is going to be a lot harder 
than everything we're normally used to, but that it's also going to be really, 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 really fun in the sandbox mode. Cooking processor. Where is that? Blah. Okay, cooking processor. Oh, this is the cooking processor. And there goes everything one by one. I now need olive oil, herbs, and spices. Herbs be in the herbarium? Are you my herbarium? Entire sprig of basil. Uh, okay, basil. And then olive oil, salt. Where's the salt? Alright, 35 grams. Let's not make the same mistake. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect, it's good. Alright, let's get some dried oregano. As usual, olive oil is super expensive. Okay, let's get this poured very nicely. Gotta make a perfect pizza sauce my first day. All right, there we go, 200. We need a GN container. I'm going to have to find out what GN means. Okay, GN container inserted. Prepare the sauce with the green button. Do not touch the red button. Yes, self-explanatory. The cooking process will need some time to finish mixing the sauce. I don't think it will, I think it's done. Pick up the basket and go back to the pantry. I left my basket in the pantry. Gather a lot of stuff. Wow, why do I need all of this? What are you, white onion? How much do I need, five? Okay. Okay, what now? Cheddar, don't need that. Gonzola? No. That's a lot of parmesan. Hmm, what else do we need? Garlic? No. What about whatever's in here? Ah, this is where you keep the mozzarella. Yeah, I'll take that. Uh, salami? Sure. Then where's this black olive and sweet corn? Um, uh, let's see. Black olive, sweet corn. I found it. Black olive, sweet corn. Alright, that is everything. Let us follow this green line magically pasted onto the floor. Pick up the container. Yes. Oh, that's really cool. This is what the sauce are. Alright, pick up the salami. Put it into the automatic cutter. Okay, check. And mozzarella gets to go into the electric grater, I guess. But first, let's make sure all of them have GN containers. You, on. Mozzarella, in there. On you go. Insert the cut salami into the shelf. Okay. Insert the grated mozzarella. Time to show you another trick. Pick up an onion, stick it in the cutter. Okay. Pick up the basket with the ingredients. Oh, that's cool. Since there's one onion in there, it fills in a lot of onions. Container. On. Grab sweet corn. And just, I guess, deposit it into there. Okay. I guess I'm gonna have to do this every single day, which is just a slightly terrifying thought. All right, let's have these olives. Let's grab a GN container, put it in there, grab these, feed them to the shelf. Oh, this is where the pizza dough came out. Ah. If I didn't have a tray, would it just go onto the floor? That's everything, we can call it a day. To finish the preparation phase, cut the clock. Day one, sold one pizza. Okay, only one quest left to finish in the introductory section. Complete an order. Accept a new order, prepare the pizza, and serve it. That's it. Ring the bell. Well, that's cool. Pugilis. Order details. Dough, sauce, awesome. Did all of these yesterday. Pin the order, blah, blah, blah. Know what to do. Let's go. So I need medium dough. How do I do that? Oh, that's cool. 
gold dough. Okay. Dough has been gold. Check. Pizza's base also needs to be well baked. Uh, we'll read about that later. Sauce. Customers do not like sauceless pizza. So as long as you put any sauce on a pizza, you will receive a star. Unless somebody orders pizza without sauce. Okay, got it. Silver star using the ordered sauce. Remember that it has to be the recipe to count. So if I put any sauce, I get a bronze star. The correct sauce, silver, and like the correct sauce, correct amount. Okay. Mariana sauce. Now we need to get cheese. Okay, let's add, I guess, the cut mozzarella. Spread cheese evenly. I'm gonna do what you told me in the tutorial, Papa Pepe. That's not even in the slightest. All right, great. I'm gonna dump cheese all over it. And now we have to spread ingredients all over. Okay. Cut white onions. All right, I'm just gonna click and click. Looks fairly even. I mean, do I just then click, 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 click? Okay. Take a plate from down here. Ah, yes, plates. Medium plates. So that'll be just plates. Place on counter. Oh, you wanted a specific spot on the counter. Oh, I'm so sorry. Those are some levitating olives. Okay. All right, let's uh, fire up the oven, I guess. It seems to be ignited, so we'll grab the pizza peel. Grab the pizza. And then with its levitating olives, just uh, stick it in there, I guess. Now, uh, I'm just gonna stare at this, I guess. I really, really, really want to click incinerate. Looks to be almost done, so I'll just grab the pizza peel for good measure. And grab it. Okay, it's out of the oven. Now what do you want me to do? Place it on the plate. Try not to break it. Ah! Oh god, the poor dough. Oh no. Oh god, I've made a mess of this whole kitchen like many, many times. Levitating all of dough everywhere. It's great though, it's great, honestly. That was, that was great. Alright, how do we do? Claim your rewards. Uh, Rosemary? I guess? Sausage? And... Young artichoke, because it looks horrendous. Choose your perk. Replace an order or replace a quest. I feel like the quest will be harder, so... Let's see here. Alright, we did great. The cheese was melted well. We completed our quest. Alright, take a look at the wall next to the serving window. It's a certificate, proving that I've granted the rank of novice. Ah, this looks hand-drawn. I love it. So we're gonna fill this whole wall with certificates? I like that. Alright, quest villa. Instead of just one quest, you'll have three active quests. Oh, it's in speed specialization? Very fast? Quantity specialization? And quality. Hmm, I like that. After you complete quests, gain a certificate. Higher tiers mean more demanding quests. Bye bye. All right. Well, uh, I think that was a very good start. I'm fairly sure we're now in the preparation phase, but I'm just gonna declare the day to be over. It's been plenty of time. So I'm just gonna pick up the dough that I sent into the stratosphere. Um, and then I think next time we are going to actually work on making some pizzas. That dough lump just fell from the top of the window. How, 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 all right? Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you liked what you saw and you want me to make more pizzas. And I'll see you all next time. Bye, everybody.